Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Random GP, episode 117, and I'm school from the Burner Bros, and we're playing an add-on for Forza Horizon 2. It's the Fast and Furious add-on, the Fast and Furious 7 add-on, where you have all the cars from the movie in the game, and it's a standalone add-on, so you don't actually have to have Forza Horizon 2. You can play it separately. It's actually free up until the end of April 10th. And so if you're seeing this the day I'm uploading it, you still have a chance to get it. But after that, I believe it's $10. Definitely worth that. Because this game is sick. It is awesome. And this is just part of the game. This isn't even the whole game. But right here, what we're doing is a rival uh, race. What it is is after you race a race and you earn the car, because you're going around, there's 10 cars you got to collect. Ludacris is uh, directing you around the map as you're in South France. And so Ludacris is telling you where to go to get these 10 different cars that you got to collect. And whoa, look at that. I'm crashing into some stuff there on the side of the road. But as you're collecting these cars, you know, you race to get them. And then afterwards, a rival comes up and they give you the option, like, do you want to race your rival? Basically, it's uh, based off of the time that you got, and so then you're going to be racing against somebody else, a real player from around the world. You know, you'll be racing against their time. So the better you do, the more you like go up the rival rankings, and you get different rivals that become available to you. So I was like, yeah, I'll do the rival thing. You know, is that this race right here? I did pretty good on it. So I was like, yeah, I think I could do even better because I actually had to come from behind. But right here, I was going through the streets. I believe this is Nice in France is what the where we're at at the moment, if I'm correct. I could be wrong. I know we're in South France, though. Driving around the streets. The graphics are sick. I'm not sure how good it's coming across through the uh, game capture and with the video editor that I'm using. I mean, the game capture is good. It's Elgato, the top one that they have available. But the the film editor is I'm not sure how the quality if it's really coming across as good as it is when you're playing it because I'll tell you it's unbelievable when you're playing this game like all the background and everything it looks so real you almost I mean <laughs> I'm just blown away by how good the graphics are personally that's just me I don't know about you let me know in the comments below what do you think do you are the graphics coming across as good as they are and also, if they're not, you can always go and hit that gear button, and go to the settings, and put it into 1080p if you're not already seeing this in 1080p. But thank you very much for watching. It is greatly appreciated. Right there, you saw we beat the rival. We beat him by seven and a half seconds. So that was pretty awesome. Let us know what you think, as I said in the comments. Thanks for watching. It's greatly appreciated. Peace.